everyone and welcome back to my channel. I hope by my top of my ears you can kind of guess the theme of today's video but I will be filming my mini ear collection. I'm so excited to share this with you. I've got quite a small collection but I'm hoping it'd be cool if I filmed it sort of now and then in six months time you can see the difference of what other ears I've bought. Um, I was inspired to do this by Lydia from Tangled in Disneyland I think her channel name is but I will link her Instagram and her channel below. <laughs> So let's start with the classic mini ears, they match my top. Um, these I got in Disneyland Paris in July and I just, everyone needs a pair of classic mini ears in their collection I feel. Um, they're not the most comfortable, I have got a fat head, I say this all the time, but I do and so I find headbands really uncomfortable so these I can kind of wear for a little bit, if I wore them all day I would have a massive headache at the end of the day which I did in Disneyland Paris and um, so I tend to only wear these for pictures and like short periods of time but I just love the big chunky bow and I think they look really cute and classic and so I will keep these forever. Next up is this pair which is actually from Primark. Um, these were like three to five pounds, I can't quite remember when I picked them up last year but they are really cute and they've got a thinner headband so they are a lot more comfortable. I'm not sure whether I'm going to take these to Florida or not. Um, I just think the sparkles would look really cute for pictures by the castle and because they are comfy but they're a little bit fragile with the sequins so let me know if you think I should take these to Florida or not. The next sets of ears are all from Etsy shops so I will leave all the Etsy links down below. So to start with we've got these red velvet ones, these are from a brand called Characterful Crafts. Um, I really really like their company because you can pick, like they're all customisable, so you can pick the colour velvet and the colour bow you like. I got these for Christmas photos and things like that, but also these would be really good for Valentine's Day because they're red, the colour of love, and they are a slightly thicker headband, so again I wouldn't be wearing these all day, but again for a quick picture or for a short period of time, I think they're really cute. These are again from Characterful Crafts. These are one of my favourite pairs of ears. These have got a really thin headband so they're so comfy and these will 100% be coming to Animal Kingdom with me because they are Lion King print. I chose this fabric and the blue bow to match because there's some blue in the fabric and I think these are going to look awesome. I've got a Lion King themed outfit planned so I'm so excited to wear these and I just love the sparkle of the bow. I think it's really cute and they're put together so well and I'm so, so excited to wear these. So on the theme of Lion King, I've got these ears. I originally bought these ears for Walt Disney World, um, but they are just too precious for me to take. I just can't. They're so beautifully designed and you've got Simba and Nala and they're stuck on and I just, I'm so worried they get damaged or bits would melt off in the heat. Like it just worries me too much and they're too beautiful not to wear. Again, they have got the thicker headband, so fathead girls or guys like me, these probably wouldn't be an all day wear, although they are quite comfy actually for a thicker headband, but I think how, where they come below the ear, it doesn't pinch, but um, I'd probably give them like a 6 out of 10 comfort, bearing in mind nothing against a 10 out of 10 because I don't like having things on my head, <laughs> but yeah, they are pretty comfy for a thicker headband, um, but they're just so beautiful that I just can't bear the thought of taking them away, they're just display ears only. Okay, another pair of ears from that brand. I think it's called Magic Dream Wishes. Um, and there's zero ears. I love Nightmare Before Christmas. And so as soon as I saw what these ears, I had to get them. But again, they're so delicately beautiful. He's even got like a little pumpkin on the end of his nose. So these are my display Halloween ears. Um, because, or for pictures, I don't think I could bring myself to wear these in the park because again, they're just so stunning. I would be so worried anything would happen to them. If you've got any tips on how to display ears without putting them on the wall, I'd really love to know. Because we're renting this flat, I don't want to be putting all my ears up everywhere, like putting things on the wall. I just don't really want to do that. So I love that look and when we buy somewhere I will for sure be having a place, a nice big wall where I can put all of my ears. But if you've got any way of storing your ears without putting them on the wall, please let me know because at the moment all my ears are just... Not, I was going to say shoved in a box, they're nicely placed in a box, but under the bed and so they don't get the love that they deserve. So let me know if you've got any storage suggestions, please. Okay, this pair of ears is probably the most beautiful, stunning pair of ears. I just, just look at them. Could you get, if you think Toy Story, could you get any more Toy Story than these ears? You've got the shoe that says Andy, I'm not sure if you can see it, but it says Andy. You've got the cloud print, you've got Woody, and you've got Buzz. Oh, siren. 
I hope they're okay. So I just, I just think these ears, I, I'm a sucker for a big puffy bow. It's what gets me in a pair of ears and I just am in awe of these ears every time. So again, like the Etsy link will be below. I believe the company is called Wishes in Wonderland, but I think the Etsy shop is called something different. So I will just leave the link below, but I love them. And I can't wait to wear these at Toy Story Land. I've got a couple of Toy Story outfits planned. So let me know if you want to see those and how I'm gonna pair their ears with them. I'm probably gonna do it over on my Instagram on IGTV, so head on over to see those. Okay, last but not least, probably my favorite pair of ears because they're so comfortable. Um, it's Forky. As soon as I saw to Toy Story 4, I knew I needed everything Forky in my life. And, um, these are just the most incredible. They're so different to every other pair of ears I've seen. They're like a vinyl and then Forky is stitched on. And I just, I'm in love. It's got a thin headband, 10 out of 10. So yeah, these probably comfort are like a nine out of 10 with 10 being nothing on my head. These are just, I cannot wait to wear these pretty much every day probably because they're so comfortable. And I don't know if you can see, but it's a shiny white, but it's, you could pick the color of your vinyl and your bow. And so I thought, this would look cool. So that is my favourite pair of ears. The shop is called Cheeky Beans UK and I've ordered a, and oh, I'm so excited, I can't even talk. I've ordered another pair of ears from her and I'm so excited for those to come. So I'll show you those when they arrive. So they are all my ears. I hope you enjoyed. Again, it's quite a small collection for now, but I'm so excited to grow it and I hope you're excited too. I will see you in the next video and goodbye.